What's up YouTube? This is Eric with OneHive 2.0. Me and a couple of the guys have decided to start over OneHive Lives and let's get it started by a live attack. We're going to be attacking their number 8 and we're kind of going to go over their plan. i got a nice little sketch drawn up here. Um, we already had an attack by Days, so we kind of know how the bottom part is just going to work out. He didn't use exactly the strategy I did, he just wants something a little bit different, but this is how he started. He dropped two loons on each of the south archer towers, one on each cannon, and then two on the bottom wizard tower. And he did this to pull the CC and just kind of clear those five defenses up. And I'm doing that with my hogs, just so the hog pathing is never going to have to see that and just kind of make a nice clean U shape. And I also probably will be able to avoid the giant bombs that are... There's a test limit between each Archer Tower and Gold Storage here, and there's a giant bomb below them. So hopefully I never even have to deal with those. So what I'm going to be doing after I pull those is kind of just doing a nice little 2-1-2 at the bottom here and just cleaning up the CC troops that he has and then also just keeping a constant cleanup since there'll be nothing that's really in range of the witches. And after that's done... As we know, it's all good. We're going to be starting up top with two golems, followed by two wizards on each gold mine, just making a nice funnel towards the middle. We're going to be dropping two wall breakers, followed by heroes. And after that, we will be dropping a jump spell once they get close enough over on the left side to make my golems and heroes just kind of funnel to the left side. So we can start hogs on the right side when things are still hopefully hitting those and as, as soon as we know the heroes are going to be down. But also, we know that after these all go through, we're going to have the three drop or the three finger drop hogs going this way. And we're going to be cleaning up these three, dropping a heal. There's a Tesla in between the Town Hall and Barb King, Town Hall and Archer Queen. And we will be dropping the heals. The first one's probably going to be a little bit deeper than I have drawn, just to kind of keep the uh, Tesla and Giant Bomb if it hits it over there, just so they keep full health over there. Also, we will be dropping the second heal over the Tesla over here, and third one over the Tesla here. And they're going to be really making a nice, just honestly, U-shape just because of the hog path. These can be so nice for that since these are all gone. And hopefully when it gets to this end, the golems will still be alive. And I will not really need the heal spell over here. That's why we have the first three initial ones over here. So, let's see how it goes. Alright, so looks like we got everything in. Everything's ready. Going to go ahead and give eight a shot. Make sure we look over one more time. Everything looks good. Let's do it. It looks like it's going pretty well. Alright, so looks good. Looks good. Getting dirty. And we're going to go ahead and go in. First heal. Clean up shoots going, second heal. Alright, 
Uh, seal spell. We just still hitting the gobs, he's looking good. He's hitting the wall, of course, but looking like it's gonna be a three. Things went as planned as it looks. A lot of hogs live, yeah, we got it. Awesome, 30 seconds to spare. I'm gonna go ahead and watch it one more time, see how it all went. See, we knew the balloons were going to work because we had someone going beforehand to do the exact same thing. So that was very nice for me. And I was also going to pull the CC and we knew there wasn't a loon in there because we pulled the balloons. Everything got just out in time. I think we had to use one more wizard than we would have liked to, but... That worked out well. We still have plenty for cleanup. Golems went as planned. Wall breakers were perfect. Funnel went in well. Jump spell worked. I don't know where they were supposed to. Everything looked like it went well. This spell went great. Never even triggered that giant bomb that was above that Tesla. It triggered that giant bomb, but the heal was there. And everything was hitting the golem still over on this side, so I didn't even really need that heal other than that giant bomb. Awesome, glad I could give you guys a three star. Thanks for watching.